John Parker was born in Claremont, Minnesota. His love of the outdoors would later lead him to an extensive career as a conservation officer. After high school, he went on to attend Rochester Junior College and joined the Army Air Corps in 1943. He received his commission as an officer in 1944. After flight training and earning his wings, he trained in the P-47 Thunderbolt and was deployed to Italy where he flew 61 combat missions as a member of the 350th Fighter Group. His follow-on orders sent him to the Aleutian Islands to fly the P-38 Lightning. During his time in the military, he earned the Air Medal with two Oak Leaf Clusters along with several other awards and battle stars. Following the war, Parker transitioned out of the military and joined the Minnesota Department of Conservation, where he became one of the first four pilots to be designated as a flying game warden. In 1948, he began his flight duties and was eventually assigned to the War Road area, where he spent his entire 34-year career. He flew numerous missions tracing the Elk Range in northern Minnesota. He found a way to herd the animals from the air, thus restricting the range of the elk and their habit of destroying farm crops. His next project was to track timber wolves. In the 1950s, wolves were considered destructive to livestock. From the air, it was possible to track collared wolves to learn their habits and ranges of individual packs. Parker would also spend hours in the air tracking ducks, cranes, moose, and other species. Challenging weather and low-level flying were common hazards throughout his career. Parker has also taken part in countless searches for lost hunters and fishermen. On several occasions, he was needed to search for drowning or crash victims. He was cited by several organizations for his willingness and determination to find those missing persons using his flying abilities. He also tracked weather balloons through their radio beacons, finding their landing locations so that ground personnel could retrieve them for the valuable data they provided. He retired from the DNR in 1982. Parker contributed to his community, serving as War Road's Director of Youth Hockey for 20 years. Parker served on the War Road Airport Commission, helping the community's grass strip become a regional airport. He belonged to the local Lions Club, the American Legion, and was a church trustee and a school board member.